Hello everybody. Welcome back to how to build a B1 bomber. Ten minutes at a time. And good morning. Or early afternoon. Whatever you want to call it. It's kind of a lazy old morning. I got involved in watching TV show to tell you the truth. <laughs> I am ready. I got my end done yesterday, by the way. Now I'm going to get this front edge done today. Now I gotta get her waxed up. So I figured y'all want to watch. Get ready for that Super Bowl. I had some people out there ask me what the Super Bowl was. I take it them as the people who don't watch American football. The Super Bowl is uh the NFL, National Football League, has their championship game. They just finished the playoffs, and now they're having the championship game of the NFL. And it's pretty big here in the States. We all love our football. Y'all got your sports over there. They just look funny to us. <laughs> We like our football over here. It's an interesting game. Rough. Rough sport. Not as rough as that rugby. They wear helmets and shoulder pads and stuff. You know, just a, just a man thing. I don't know, there's women football fans, I guess. Super Bowl is, and uh, got a couple other questions over here right now. Hold on. Oh, how come I never say hi to the people in the UK? I want to tell you guys something. I knew that was going to come up sooner or later, and the reason. I don't say hi to the people in the UK. Because I just never really thought about it. <laughs> Sorry about that, guys. I'm going to get a shout out to everyone in the UK watching. What's up, fellas? I'm going to get a shout out to everybody watching this morning. I don't care where you are in the world. I don't care what you do for a living. If you like airplanes, you're welcome to the shop. That's the only qualification. You gotta have a sense of humor. See? That's what it's all about right there. Oh, get me a good coat of wax. I already waxed this top one. And the bottom one, the one I did first, you know, I had it all waxed up. Well, give me a good coat of wax over all this. And we're going to get this laid up today. Then we're going to let it set for about a week. <laughs> let old B-Man, B1B man, sweat it out. I put my wires on this this morning just to kind of rush the steps along a little bit. I had to make so many movies of the same thing over and over again. But man, I'm gonna, it's going to be a milestone when these swing molds are done. And we can take them to Texas. Big old snowstorm on the way. Supposed to be here tonight. I guess the East Coast has got hammered. They're talking a couple feet of snow. And Canada's having the warmest 
summer ever. Love them Winter Olympics too, man. I like watching them Winter Olympics. That's about my favorite out of the Olympic Games. I like to watch the bobsledding and uh, the toboggans, you know, the luges. Oh, I love watching that stuff. And that ice game, you know, where they slide them big old chunks of lead, or big old rocks on the ice. I like watching that too. Them people are into that stuff, man. I never knew there was a game like that. Don't take that offensively wherever that game is from. I don't know where it's from. I think it's from Norway somewhere. You know what I really like watching on the Summer Olympics? I like all Olympics, but uh, badminton. Man, you want to talk about some people into badminton? I never knew that was an Olympic sport until I watched it last time. Some people are into that stuff, man. That old birdie was doing 200 mile an hour. Bam, 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 bam. They was knocking that thing. Man. I still got my stuff inside there, but I want to get a lot of wax out without scrubbing on it real hard. You guys need to try that, put your wax in a sock like that. Man, that works good. Get her started, put a little extra on there. Oh, and Paul, I got a message for you. There, buddy. Mr. Sharp Pencil himself. We had, it took, I had to pull some strings. But, I have... Your 105 over there, I got it a stay of execution, okay? Uh, we won an appeal, and I got it a, a extra 90 days. <laughs> hey, people, hey, what was worried, Paul was worried about his 105 over there. Wait a minute, 90-day rule? <laughs> that means that 105 is on borrowed time, but... I pulled some strings for you there, buddy. You owe me one. Got it an extra 90 days in the shop. Well, that's what I want to do next, people. I want to build that big old 105 Thunder Chief. That's going to be it. That is a cool plane. And he's got it about ready, people. And that's just going to be, that won't take near as long to build as this bomber. Paul already has a set of landing gear made for it. And, uh, man, I can slick that plug up and have a mold. Bam, there's a 105 sitting there. And uh, then I got that B-58 that's about ready. Got landing gear for. Don't you worry. I ain't going to leave you guys. We got airplanes to build in this shop. what I talked to Mark at Associated Industries and he said I can go down there and make a movie so I think maybe next week he, uh, he looked at me like I was crazy he said he didn't care so we can, I think maybe next week we might take our camera down to Associated Industries Make it smooth. I'll show you what all they got. Hey, Jason. Is this thing still recording? Hey, Jason. In Australia, Mark says he has a water base uh, PVA mold release. Kind of like what I, it's almost the same thing. The stuff I use is actually flammable. But he has a water base mold release that he can sell you and ship you. Go down there and ask for Mark. And uh, you can put this stuff, you can even put this part all on with the sponge. You don't have to spray it. 